Hi guys! Happy, a fabulous, a fantastic Wednesday to everybody. I hope everybody's having a fantastic day, guys. So I am back. This is my second video today. I actually wanted to do one video, but I changed three babies and I kind of like ran up my time. Um, YouTube is giving me a hard time again, guys. Like, you know, uploading videos that are an hour long. I used to love making my one hour videos, but I, you know, they, it gives me a hard time um, as far as up uploading them. And um, I have a box opening of a silicone a doll that I bought. It's, a, it's supposed to be a blank doll. I got this from AliExpress and it's silicone. It's a full body silicone so that I can practice a painting of my silicone dolls. Like, so guys, um, I had a couple of people hit me up and um, were like, that's kind of like right way. I, I had a couple of subscribers hit me up and um, just was like, hey, Marisol, we haven't heard from you. You know, you, you're not really posting videos. So guys, I've been trying to upload a video, I think since Monday. Okay, guys, but it's, it went on over an hour and i mean i keep trying to push it push it through um it's actually um a video of um clips of my journey with my first silicone doll is a partial silicone doll guys and it just was like a hot mess painting he didn't come out good granted i didn't know what i was doing well i i watched a couple of tutorials and i did have my fantastic fabulous uh, teacher guiding me um michelle elizabeth so um i you know she's a great teacher and she's a fantastic silicone um artist um she paints silicone and she micro roots her dolls which i don't know how she does it but okay she does <laughs> but um i did have her but um i kind of like it was um so the doll that I decided that I bought to first paint was a partial silicone tint um, a doll, sculpt. So I was kind of like doomed to fail, you know. But that being said, I still used it as a practice sculpt. So the silicone was tint silicone. So um, the paint that I was using um, um, was really not going to stick to it too much. So we kind of like tried a little trick to kind of like seal the doll before even putting any paint on it that kind of worked um i did get some paint on it but the baby looks like he was playing in mud um i would show you the baby the baby is all right over there but what i'm gonna do is i really do want you guys to see the process that um i was trying um on my little bit of my journey um my first i'm gonna keep them most likely he's gonna peel on me he came out like he fell and was rolling around in mud. <laughs> but all that being said, guys, um, I'm not giving up. And um, I'm actually painting another doll that's right here. Um, another full body silicone that um, I'm just practicing on, guys. And this is another one. I have another one coming. And I have my eye on the following one, which I'll probably buy it like within two, three days. Um, when I get some more cheddar cheese. <laughs> but anyways, guys, I just came because I wanted to open the switches, guys. And like I said, this is an AliExpress doll. And guys, don't think that I'm not going to say this, but I have to sign it because I got to advertise myself. To those that are new, welcome to my channel. I am Marisol. <laughs> If you watch this video and you like it, please consider liking, subscribing, hitting the notification bell and the like bell, please. So that you can get notified and bonafide whenever I make another video. Please share my videos with your dolly friends so that you can help my channel grow. And to all my faithful watchers, what's up? Oh, what's up? Oh, what is up? You know what's up? Okay, we're going to get into this box. So I'm going to um open this up and i'm going to show you but let me tell you guys right so i think everybody knows oh let me see can't see my address oh okay so i think everybody knows about aliexpress by now right and you guys know for sure that aliexpress um i i, I love aliexpress aliexpress and i were best friends 
right? Um, I do have my friend um, that had a bad experience. They she ordered from AliExpress and they kind of like left her her package like outside uh in um downstairs in the lobby like where all the mailboxes are at and you know um you know she um they they of course they took it you know we're we're, we're in New York and not unless you're living in a luxury apartment where they got you know security and stuff like that or cameras and stuff like that we don't they can't do that to me in my apartment because or in my building because they, it'll be gone before you could even you know get out the um elevator so this is how it looks right but i gotta tell you guys so what was the same so she had a bad experience um she's still like kind of like going back and forth um she's trying to see um if they give her, her back her money i've had some encounters i gotta say that um i didn't get what i ordered or it got lost so i never received it i always get reimbursed thank god i always get reimbursed you just gotta like show proof or whatever and you know if it's damaged you take a two second video or you take pictures of it you show it to them and they they, they reimburse me okay so um <clears throat> that being said i love aliexpress and i haven't had a problem the only thing that um goes on with aliexpress is that the wait right you order from them and you have to kind of like wait like anywhere from three to four weeks you know i've even waited like for just like little silly things like nail polishes and you know silly little things i've actually waited like six weeks to be honest with you but i always get it you know i always get it and i never like expect it to come like overnight never because i already know it's coming from china you know what i'm saying and so aliexpress and i we're friends because i you know time to me is going super fast so i don't mind waiting and not for the price guys not for the price for the price i will wait okay um inflation is bad and time you know before you know it you got your stuff right so that being said i bought this i bought this doll from aliexpress right and it came out to like 163 dollars with um shipping and everything it came out to like 163 right okay i did not read the fine print because you know they have rules and regulations and like um as far as like you know if you don't get it in a timely matter if whatever they have like things to assure you that you know you're gonna be okay right it's worked out for me i gotta say right but i bought this doll and i did not even read into that guys do you know that i get this um because i am waiting for another full body silicone doll right it's uh a saskia saskia is the saskia scope and it's a full body silicone doll and i did order it like maybe i want to say two three weeks okay so today's the 31st i ordered it the beginning of january right so it's been just about four weeks right okay so i got like yesterday i got like um like this tracking saying that i'm receiving you know ups is gonna it has a delivery for me so i thought that i was receiving that sculpt right guys I got this sculpt and I just ordered it three days ago. And I was like, wait, that's coming from China. No freaking way that it could be that doll. Guys, I looked at the tracking. I looked at the name. And when I went back and then on top of that, they sent me a thing like saying like, hey, it's in your region. Like, you know, it's, you know, it's in your country or whatever. Like, you know, it should be like I'm there before the second because their policy has a three day um um rule like you you get your stuff in three days and i literally got this in three freaking days guys okay okay so i got it in four days i got it in four days because it was scheduled ups had this scheduled to be delivered yesterday and then they they changed it was supposed to be here like by one o'clock and then i got another um update on the ups thing then it said like by 
7 o'clock. And then I got another update saying tomorrow. So tomorrow is today. And then it said today by 8.30 or 8.45. And the UPS guy came super early. He brought it like around 1 o'clock. But then I had to take a shower. And I was changing my bed sheets. And I was washing the laundry and all that stuff. So I was like, I want to open this on camera. And let me tell you guys, it's supposed to be a blank silicone a doll guys i'm so going to order from them again like i'll pay an extra you know because it was like it was like one you, basically shipping was 20 bucks you know shipping was 20 bucks and i was like i'm just gonna get it i'm just gonna get it i'm just gonna get it 20 bucks i will pay an extra 20 dollars to get it in three days yes i will and i am going to actually i'm not so savvy with the whole stuff but i'm going to try to like put like edit it so you guys can see like the vendor that i got this from because i recommend them okay but before i recommend 100 percent, let's get into this box and let's see what the baby looks like i'm going to move the camera um, I just wanted to show face, tell everybody what's up, you know, because I love watching videos when you guys show your face. I want to see the face behind the face behind the voice, right? So I haven't been like really showing face, guys. I'm in my pajamas, guys. I'm always home in my pajamas. I'm not going outside, guys. Okay, uh, uh, I went outside yesterday to do an errand. The day before yesterday to do an errand, I go, I do the errand, and I come back. It's cold in New York. Okay, I'm staying upstairs. All right, <laughs> but I just wanted to say what's up and show my face and let you know that I am here. Ooh, ooh, ooh. And I'm happy and I want to show you guys at this box. So, okay, I'm gonna bring the camera close, I'm gonna face it down, and oh, I'm gonna actually put it here and I'm just gonna show you guys. All right, <laughs> all right, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's bring this down. Like that. Let's check out my press on nails. Stop playing, bitches. Uh, look, okay. And they've been through already torture, okay. But these are press ons and they cost me a dollar and ninety nine. Two dollars. Two dollars. I'm gonna go back. I got them from Lotless. I love at the store Lotless. I got these at Lotless for a dollar ninety nine. And I just wasn't sure if they were gonna be good, but they are working out fine. They're pretty sturdy. And I'm going to go get myself another 52 packs. <laughs> These guys know I'm crazy, guys. These guys know I'm crazy. I don't got my my knife. Like, uh-uh. What's going on? Why I don't got my knife? This is crazy. And then it has a lot of tape. Okay. Um, right? Uh, what? I'm not a... I'm losing my Puerto Rican skills. Puerto Rican people need to have, you know, we have knives, guys. We have knives. I don't know what's going on. I'm losing my, I'm losing my skills. Okay, that's it. Okay. <coughs> okay. Got them okay? Okay. I think it's one of those. Got a pool. Oh, let's see. Oh, no. Oh, no, I hope this is not a tin silicone. I'm a little bit traumatized right now. And why I'm saying that is because, I mean, it feels. Why I'm saying that is because this. Let me show you guys. Hold on. Let me move these knives. I mean, I'm not. It's so You know why I'm saying that, guys? Because, yeah, I think it is tin. Oh, my gosh. I'm a little bit traumatized. Oh, it's a boy. But you know why I'm saying that? Because you see the oil on this? You see the oil on this? That's what Michelle told me. Wash the silicone real, real good with acetone. She also told me to, um, oh man. That would really, really suck ass, guys. So this is how it came, okay? And it's like bleeding oil. And she told me that. I don't know. I got to talk to her, Michelle. So this is the little outfit that it came with, right? Okay. This little outfit, which I think is really, really cute. See? 
It's really, really stinking cute, right? Oh, and it has a hat. Little hat. Right? This is a really cute outfit, right? And guys, I don't want nobody to get offended. It's Remember guys, it's only a doll, okay? It's a full body silicone doll. And it is a boy, and I don't want you guys to get offended or anything like that. I don't want to get flagged, but look, you see this oil stuff? See this? I, I, I'm not sure if this is a tin silicone, and if it is, it's, uh, it, it, I wouldn't be able to even practice on it because I already experienced, like I just said, I practiced on a tin silicone, and it just doesn't take the, the paint. But I'm not sure. Let's see. I'm, I'm just going to... Um, This is material silicone, full body silicone, baby. I wish it would say if it was platinum silicone or any type of silicone on the, on the thing. But anyways, guys, I'm not, you know, I'm a positive, uh, you know, I'm a positive person. Um, Okay, let me get the pillow and let me kind of, let me, I'll come back in two seconds. Well, no, not even. No need of stopping yet. Let me just move this baby. Oh, goodness. Okay. Put you right here. All right. Let's get this poppy. All right. Like that. Let's get this behind it. So we could get a little bit of leverage. Right? Um, And let's get... Let's get, you know what I'm looking for? A diaper, because I don't want to get flagged. All right, that's the, and I think I already like, kind of like, okay guys, uh, give me a second. Hmm. All the diapers in the world, and you think when you really need one, oh, here it goes. <coughs> My brother, my brother is—he be cracking himself up. All right, here we go. Oh, 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 o
it really is but it could be also the oils from from the mold because you know when they take it when they put it in the mold it's like oily and stuff like that so i'm not sure i'm just trying to be optimistic about it um let's see the seams aren't that bad on this one the last one that that i got the seams aren't bad at all guys at all oh, oh, oh. they're not too bad at all guys you know they're not like where you can really like feel them not bad and it's very very floppy as you can see look at this Boingy, boingy, boingy. Okay. And it's like 20 inches. That's what she said. 20 inches. And the silicone really feels nice. So they sell these scopes. Like I said, this one was $163. A ship, tax, and everything. And um, it's very, very, very soft. And I they, they do have it already painted. Lightly painted or whatever. So, you know, like if you guys, but I'm just buying these scopes because I really want to um, practice my, my skills on painting silicone. So I'm really hoping and praying that um, I'm going to wash it right after this video. I'm going to wash this um, silicone doll. I'm going to wash it with um, with um, acetone and then I'm going to give it a good acetone wash and then I'm going to give it uh, soap and water very very good wash and then i'm gonna dap it dry and just put it on some on a paper bag to see if it continues uh for 24 hours to see if it continues um shedding out you know like grease or oil and stuff like that and if it does then that means that oh i suck ass and it doesn't it's not gonna be um a good doll for me to paint but you know, like I said, it might be just that, you know, when it when they put it in the mold, they um they put it in the mold with you know they they, they have to kind of like uh kind of like um use some type of a oil base um thing to like they could kind of like take it out the mold, you know, so um it could be that they just took it out the mold and they never um they never you know washed it or anything like that right because at this price right i mean guys this is a whole full body silicone doll and it was like 163 dollars i mean we paying a lot of money for silicone granted you know is um i know it's a lot of work and stuff like that you know whatever you know moldings and stuff like that but really honestly guys you know inflation is bad you know it's like you know it's times are tough you know and we have bigger and better things to kind of like spend you know our money on so if you could get yourself a silicone doll to like you know if you want to just experience and stuff like that of a silicone doll and um you could get it for under two hundred dollars. I mean, shit, it sure beats. Uh, you know, you spending thousands of dollars. Granted, I have a silicone doll that I have on layaway that cost me over two thousand dollars, and it's not painted, but it's. I love the sculpt. It's by uh, DNG. DNG Studios or D. Oof. Okay, I forgot the damn name straight off from the top of my head, but it's um it's a big giant doll and it's a lot more realistic and I just fell in love with it. You know, and then again, guys, you know, I'm saying all that, you know, because a lot of people don't have the money to spend. I don't have the money to spend, but I'm not like I don't count my pennies, nickels, and dimes. And like I said before, um, many, many um, of times, if I have it, I want it, I get it. I'm spoiled. I don't, you know, I don't, I don't do, you know, I, 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 my taste is a little bit kind of like, 
I mean, I don't want to say bougie. I'm not a bougie person, but I be liking nice stuff. Like, I do. I mean, we all like nice stuff, right? But I be like liking nice stuff, and I don't want to hesitate. I don't want to cut my cut my corners. I don't be wanting to cut my corners. I want what I want. I like what I like, and I usually go for it. I live my life like that, you know? Tomorrow's never promise, and I want to live my, my best life at all times. So, like, I don't care about money. I don't have it like that, but when I do get it, I, I spend it. You know, I, I buy, I get my, I get what I, I get what I, I get, you know, I get what I want. And, um, I love my girl Spring Flower over there at the, um, at the Spring Flower at the Amazing Doll Connection. She, um, that's her channel, guys. I know you guys know about my girl Spring. And if you don't, you need to go over there and, um, just play with her. She has the best dolls and she's, she has the best energy. Right. Oh, look at him, guys. He's super cute. And he's not even painted. He's so sweet. I love him. Oh, no, he's cute. This little outfit is giving me, you looking like a wow. Oh, he's looking like a wow. But, um, yeah, over there at the Amazing Doll Connection, Spring Flower, she is uh, the same way. We have a lot of the same similarities when it comes to money and wanting what we want. We want to live life to the best, to the fullest. We don't cut corners, you know. Um, and that being said, you know, um, I wanted that silicone doll. It was like a little bit over $2,000. And I, yeah, I put it away. And I'm currently paying off on it. And by the time I have it paid off... I will have three really nice silicone dolls that um, I'm trying to practice painting um, these dolls so that I can kind of like give it a whack on my own, you know, painting my own dolls. Like I want to in the future, I want to buy my own silicone dolls and be able to experience painting them myself instead of, you know, paying $2,000 plus. I mean, it costs like two plus two thousand plus dollars just to get them painted. I mean, it's a lot, you know, according to the artist. The cheapest I found was fifteen hundred, and it's still a thousand five hundred dollars. If I could do it myself, uh, I could get put another five hundred dollars and get myself another damn scope. You know what I'm saying? So that being said, that's the reason why I'm I'm moving forward. Um, I have had just about three people hit me up and say, I know you're just like starting your journey with silicone painting, silicone, but um, you know, um, they I guess. They buy blank kits like this, and then, you know, they're like, oh, you know, if you could, being that the whole controversy about knockoffs or whatever, I don't know what scope this is. I don't care if it's a knockoff. I get what I want. I do what I want. So, you know, if, you know, you don't like it, go to another channel. No need in, you know, sticking around or just whatever. You know, I really don't care. Nobody pays my bills. If you don't want me to practice or you are offended by me doing anything with knockoffs, Hey, I can give you my address and you could just send me original scopes and you could buy it so I can practice and fuck it up. <laughs> I'm not going to fuck up my good money on authentic scopes. I'm not going to do that. Nope, I'm not. So that being said, we'll practice like this. And when I get good and I'm confident on what I'm doing, then I'll paint my authentic scopes. But in the meantime... Um, I've had like three people hit me up and tell me like when I'm confident with my painting and I get it down packed that if I can paint their silicone dolls because ba basically they're knockoffs or whatever and the answer to that guys uh I don't know you don't I can't I can't tell I can't say yes because the thing with this is just like painting silicone is super 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 un un um forgiving so if you mess it up you can't really like strip it and if you, in order to strip the paint off silicone you have to sand the silicone down and i don't know that's another whole freaking process I, i'm not there yet um it will be honestly it will be uh years before i will be confident enough to like uh paint a silicone doll for somebody you know what i'm saying you know, I don't want to, like, mess anything up and then just be responsible. And people get, also, a lot of times, people are very finicky in what they want. And they're like, oh, well, you know, I really didn't want that. I want that. I want this. And they try to give you orders and stuff like that. And like I said, I, I don't know. I'm just winging stuff. 
at this time but i wanted to show you guys that my little man over here is going to get a paint job we're gonna give him a bath suck your finger suck your finger oh you don't want that one you want this one and suck this one oh my god no he don't want that he's not a thumb sucker but i feel that this was a really really good buy um i'm not sure if it was just taking out the mold and it's still oily and then they just put it in the box and they shipped it out it could be that um or it could be um i don't know we're gonna find out we're gonna find out we're gonna find out oh, oh. i think that the quality of the silicone is really really nice it's really nice really super um you know soft you know what i'm saying and um I, 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 I like this a lot. I really like it a lot. I'm going to wash it up. I'm going to give it a good wash. I'm going to give it, um, I'm going to dry it up, wash it up. And I'm going to see if this guy um, is just probably just straight out the mold. And then that's why the box is oily like that. Um, he totally feels like silicone. Um, the one that I did that was tin, the material felt a lot lighter. But I don't know about silicone. Uh, maybe maybe he is silicone and maybe he's not but the stinky leg the stinky leg he's giving you the stinky leg but i really really love him and let me tell you guys if he is um straight up silicone marisol is going to order another one they have an awake one that looks just like this one but awake and i really like kind of like want to get that one but that's my video for today, guys. I just wanted to show you guys my silicone baby. And um and tell you guys that um thank you so much for um also being concerned about like hey where you been? I haven't seen your videos. I'm I was actually painting the silicone doll and I've been trying to upload the video um and it's giving me a hard time i think i'm gonna go back and kind of like chop it up like into two videos so then this way you guys can see the you know the whole thing but that being said guys i love you guys so so very much thank you very very much for spending your time with me for um supporting me for giving me your love for being concerned when i'm like missing in action i appreciate each and every one of you guys for my new subscribers and my old subscribers thank you for being my subscribers i love you guys so so much and guys remember keep god first say a prayer be thankful be grateful and be kind to one another guys be kind be kind be kind okay boop, 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 boop. <laughs> bye <laughs> bye guys <laughs>